All right, guys, I'm going to be doing a 10-second review on these single issues. Check it out. So, uh, like, comment, subscribe. Keep it up. All right, guys, we're going to start with Venom number one. Man, is this is a good story. I cannot say, the words cannot describe this. This is exactly what the Venom story that we've been waiting for. All right, since we did Venom number one, let's do Venom number two. Man, it just gets better and better. I mean, this is like a horror story, and just like, it's perfect for the Venom symbiote. It must pick up. All right, since we did Venom number two, let's do Venom number three. Holy cow. Venom be a god. More about the Venom origins. It's amazing. Pick it up. With Captain America issue number one, if you've even just heard about Secret Empire and you know the basis of the story, you can pick this up right away. You don't have to read uh, Mark Wade's run. It's awesome. It's amazing. Pick it up. And let's talk about Death of the Inhumans. Man, Kate's can write. Man, I can't believe what he did. And man, the ending. Alright, let's switch up a bit and do DC. We'll start with Man of Steel number one. Nervous. It was a nervous th takeoff. Being a Superman fan, this was kind of eye-opening. Alright, we stayed it up with Man of Steel number one. Let's start with Man of Steel number two. This still made me nervous. If number three wasn't good enough, I'm going to cancel this. Just saying. Alright, number two. Let's go. Man of Steel number three. Holy cow. Turning point. Amazing. Exciting. Pick it up. Alright. Man of Steel number four, pretty good. I mean, I love the covers. They're awesome. Really eye gripping. Bendis knows what he's doing now. Pick it up. All right, Man of Steel number five, pretty good. I mean, so far it's getting to that you know top point, and yeah, I, I got nothing bad to say about. It. And finally, Man of Steel number six. Holy cow, the fight scenes. Finally figuring out what happened to, to John and Lois. I can't wait. And we'll start off with Justice League, issue number one. If you guys remember the Justice League animated series back in the day, this is the same thing almost. It's awesome. It's nostalgic. I can't wait for more. And let's go with Justice League number two. Holy cow. Better and better. Scott Snyder knows how to write a Justice League comic. And I'm most excited for is the Ultraviolet uh, core. And last but not least, let's go with Justice League number three. Just, there's nothing wrong with this guy. This guy can do anything. Scott Snyder, keep going. You're doing great at this. Alright guys, that's it for the 10 second reviews this week. Thanks for watching. Hope you enjoyed. Like, share, subscribe. Check me out on YouTube, Comic Man Jake.